Hi guys, FIFA with SHD here, and it is a squad builder, and it's a K-League team. It's in a 3-4-1-2, I've actually never had a K-League team before, so I just decided, you know what, let's go with it. I've never had one before, so try them out. I've heard of a couple of players are good, like the 8-6 pace centre-back, which I do have, and Informanino, which I also have. So let's get into it. The goalkeeper, it'll probably be easier. Most of them are silvers, and a couple of are golds. So in goal we've got... Uh, Kim Young Quang, uh, <laughs> 71 diving, 72 handling, 71 kicking, 70 reflexes, 71 positioning. So all round good stats, but he's quite a bad goalkeeper. I mean, I wouldn't really use him if I had a silver team. And I think there was another keeper, but it was cost quite a bit because a lot of these players are quite expensive. The only reason being because they're so rare, because most people just discard them. Like I said, next centre back is De Vere, 66 pace, 78 defending, 76 heading, obviously in M form. Going to be on the 10k, pay 13.5k. Not too bad. Uh, he's a decent defender, he's not too. Yeah, it's alright, does the job, I guess. Next silver centre back is Kim. Kim Jong Young. Kim Ju Young, sorry. 86 pace, 72 defending, 67 heading. Obviously, in main stats, the 86 pace does really help in this game especially pace oriented game and he's a great centre back really would recommend him 4k for someone with 86 pace that centre back can't go wrong next silver centre back if I can find him is this bloke Park Young Ho uh, 70 pace 68 defending 71 heading only one I could find in my formation 350 coins and there wasn't really any other good other centre back except for these two a lot. I had to buy a lot of formation cards. It's just because these players are so rare. Right mid, we have Lee Lee Sung Hong. Or Lee Sung Hong Yong. I don't know. <laughs> 93 pace, 74 dribbling, 63 pass, and terrible. Well, not great stats. Let's be honest. But there's just the pace, isn't it? And they get a couple of crosses in. Paid five and a half k for him. Very good player. Just because he can pace for it and cross it in, basically. Left mid, we have Kim Chi Wu. <laughs> oh, I love these players' names. 82 pace, <laughs> 70 passing, and that's it. He's he's just there for the sake of it to get a bit of chemistry. And 500 coins, just there, and nothing special about him. First centre mid, we have is Kim Jai. What is that? Kim Jai Sung. 82 pace, 74 passing. That's about it again. <laughs> about 900 coins. So all these players are very, very quick. Even the midfielders for the centre mids. <laughs> Every single player is very quick. One centre mid, 82 pace. And the next centre mid is an actual, is an inform, which is Jogetti. He is actually a centre forward or a striker, but I've got him converted to centre mid. 81 pace, 85 shooting, 82 passing, 77 dribbling. Brilliant, brilliant centre mid. Cost me 16.5k because obviously he had to be converted in that, but I bought him in centre mid. So that's not too bad. Very, very good player, I would recommend him. Centre forward, we have Lee Dongguk. Lee Dongguk. Yeah, 72 pace, 88 shooting, 85 passing, 77 dribbling, 81 heading. Brilliant long shot. That's why I pay him at centre forward. He's got a quality long shot. I would really recommend him. He is a striker, I think. Got him converted to centre forward, paid nearly 19k for him. Games with 29 goals scored 30 and he's a centre forward. Shows how good he is. First striker we have is da is oh sorry I don't even know like that. Da Manjunovic, I think you that's how you pronounce it. 83 pace, 85 shooting, 80 dribbling, 72 passing, 78 heading. So quite good stats all round. They're not brilliant, but they're not too bad. Probably pay quite a bit. 18k, great finesse shot on him, and it's got a good shot. Obviously not the paceiest. But he's got a great finesse shot and will score you goals in the air and on the ground. And then the last striker to round this team up is Inform Anino, the best player on this team by far. 92 pace, 80 shooting, 77 dribbling and 70 passing. So he hasn't got really very good stats. But my god, he is a beast. He's such a quality player. I would really recommend him. Definitely the best player on this team. Now, I'm just going to quickly run through the team. Definitely the best it's going to be a goal fest when you play with this team, I'm going to be honest. Because you're going to score so many goals because of the 
the three attackers are brilliant and the midfield help out a lot but you concede a lot of goals just because of this formation with his team usually this formation wouldn't concede that many goals just because of the sentiments coming back I guess quite a bit but with this formation because their centre backs are so shit not so shit but not very good I mean him and this Duarte it, Devere isn't great they're alright but they're not bad just gonna concede a lot of goals and the goalkeeper's a pile of wank but there's not <laughs> so it's nothing you can really do about that because there's not many of that not many players in this league so yeah altogether this team cost me I'd probably say about 120k maybe a bit less I'm not sure maybe 100k but it's a very good team I'd recommend it go out and get it guys I hope you enjoyed the video please leave a like subscribe if you haven't uh, the goal's coming up in a minute and yeah cheers the future